um, I would first advise them to visit a hospital to get treated and then I'll also make sure not to discourage them, I mean by stigmatizing them and making sure they feel good because HIV isn't the end of life. Um, it would be very sad if my friend contracts HIV, um, especially the stigma that comes with it and the mental states. So from what I learned today, I have learned that if my friend contracts HIV, the best way is not to stigmatize the person, but rather to um, encourage the person to go to the hospital and get medications. Because when he continues to take his medication, it will be he or she will be able to live a normal life. So the best thing is to encourage them to get to the hospital and take their medication. You're just going to encourage the person to visit the hospital to take his drugs so that he doesn't die. Maybe When you take the drugs, there are chances of you whereby you can stay longer than the preferred time that whereby someone who is not taking the drug would. would. So you not run? No, I wouldn't run from the person. I will just tell the person to go to the hospital to seek um, drug and to be encouraged that that's not the end of life. I would advise them to go and get medication. Okay. Um, I would first advise them to visit a hospital to get treated and then I'll also make sure not to discourage them, I mean by stigmatizing them and making sure they feel good because HIV isn't the end of life. So I'll advise that you visit the nearest health facility and then the, um, you be cancelled once you are positive and then the various measures to take um, in place are discuss with you and then you are put on drugs called antiretroviral drugs and then you just make sure that you take it as you are supposed to. Yeah. Well, I'll be a little startled but I don't think that's the time where I'm supposed to distance myself from that friend. I think that's the time where I'm supposed to get close and then try and keep her company and try and help her out with stuff. She gets it. Just that I'll be a little careful. I wouldn't use anything that she has used that would have the virus on it. You get it? Or I'll just be extra careful that I don't contract it. That's why that I'm fine. I'll just try and. Oh, I'll be careful with the person because it's dangerous. If it's a life something. If you get it, you've gotten it for your whole life. There is no cure. So it's when the person uses something, I'll make sure I'll prevent myself from using it. Yes. Mm. Yes. Nowadays, there are medication for that. So you take your drugs. It wouldn't be a news to me. Yes, it wouldn't be a news. At first, most people had no idea about these things. And anytime they get tested, they, they have issues or they don't take the drugs that has been um, prescribed for them to take. So um, you see them growing lean and later die. But now, AIDS is like someone who has hypertension. Because all the time, you'll be taking drugs every month. And the HIV too, you also need the drug because with hypertension, if you don't take the drug, your pressure would go high, eventually die. Similar with the HIV. So I don't think it's more serious like first. Yeah, so it wouldn't be anything giddy giddy bad to me. Oh, like my, uh, me you need to say, like my cancer, I'm going to say, 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 I know I met my boy. Hey, today I mean I'm crying. I say me kuhu say Obi do one dance. I know boy who devil say oh say Obi ah wow na mo oh ya lebi say HIV is how can one say me ah. Since I'm in young kuno Obi nintin met my day. Hey, I think one chance say ni say ni say. So what I say? Me intro me home friend in chain. Want to me far mama? Me who say na mo ya le? Ma info ba mi nya. So on say ni adena ko eh. Me young kuno want to me mama HIV. So I don't know. What I would do if a friend contracted HIV? I'll tell them there's life after HIV because people seem to stigmatize people that have HIV. So I'll just tell them there's life after HIV and it's not the end of the world. Oh, we are not supposed to discriminate or stigmatize them. Yes. Since she has been able to tell you, you should be grateful because in a way she's trying to protect you. But the fact that she has doesn't mean we should isolate ourselves from them. We are supposed to be there for them because they actually need our love and care mm. most. So I don't think we should discriminate or stigmatize them because they have it. Because you never know how she got it. Right. Yes.